it's Angela from North Carolina and you are looking at a project that's been a while in the making. I have a small bathroom at the end of a hallway that was so small that you could barely turn around. If you were sitting on the commode, you could touch the walls. It was a very poor design and so we now have an empty, gutted bathroom. I'm so excited. And right here is going to be a big window that's going to be about five feet by five feet, maybe five by six. Not quite that tall. And under it is going to be my beautiful freestanding tub. And over here, there used to be a commode. This was a small bath, and we are now opening up and making this a water closet. And I'm going to have a beautiful black hanging toilet on the wall. I cannot wait. I took forever to pick out what I wanted, and I really think it's going to be beautiful. I'm having a real deep slate gray large tile that's going to be on the walls. And since it's a small bathroom, I picked out a small vanity that's concrete and it hangs on the wall, which is going to be really neat. So I will take you with me on my journey. They gutted, the dogs and I left because of, there were, um, oh gosh, jackhammers breaking up tile and there was so much noise this week that we left and we came back last night and now we have a subfloor. We could see all the way down to the grass, but it's all being done from scratch, like brand new, and I'm so excited. So I will take you along on my little hall bathroom renovating journey. They were kidding me that I ought to put a TV right there since there's already a TV outlet from another room. I watch enough TV, I don't want one in my bathroom. But thanks for watching, and I'll keep you posted as it starts to take shape. 